Hi, welcome back to a brand new video of the targeted individual program, targeted individual experience. So I just want to show you guys how, again, the racist, the white supremacists on Facebook, how they monitor uh, my online activity. As I said, the word monitor, you guys hear the call honking, All right? How they monitor my activity, how they engage in, again, the violation of my rights right my freedom of speech and again i'm not you know disparaging anybody uh in terms of i'm not you know uh you know spreading hate i just spread the truth i just speak the truth i speak the truth you know facebook spread more hate as an online platform than anything because they don't do this to these white supremacists who will jump on the conversation and disparage black people particularly some of these arabs that will call black people a monkey and, and do all kind of um, uh, post all kind of things that we were kings and all this nonsense while ignoring the, the, the reality and the fact that they are liars and, and, and they're narcissistic right and they steal black people culture and pass it off as their own and again that's not something that I'm saying that's my opinion that's the facts right the facts even when it's in their faces even when it's when, uh, in our faces they gaslight us as black people they gaslight us Oh, well, you know, they're, they're black, but they're not Negroid. You know, like, what the hell is that? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? But again, this is, this is what they do. So, I, and again, I, I reposted something, and this is something that was posted from another uh, um, uh, person's uh, Facebook page. And I reposted it. And, and I just said, um, I'm going to show you guys. Um, <laughs> look at it. It says, sometimes women are the worst. That's all I said. That's all I said, right? And look what happened. He says, your post is now on Facebook, but it looks similar to other posts that were removed because they don't follow our standard on hate speech. How is the hate speech? They can have women out there calling black men the N-word. You know, and again, it's, I'm not in context to, what, the, to what, I, what I shared. Yeah, sometimes women can be their own worst enemies. And sometimes they can be the worst. They can be, they'll accuse men of being hypersexual, but a lot of the times they're hypersexual. Most of the times they're the one that's hypersexual. Okay? So let me show you guys what I actually, what I posted. What I, what I shared, I should say. Right? So again, this is a, a page, that, a post that I shared. And it's, it's um, you know, it's called uh, a retroverse fitness. Got a bunch of women, right? This is what they're doing. Right, and that's fine. And and, and that's fine, right? <laughs> but I want you to look at some of the other things that they're that they're engaging with. And again, you know, I, that's fine. I have no problem with that. I'm just saying, you know, the fact that they put this shit out there like it's, you know, <laughs> let me let me show you guys again. Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. Okay. And the fact that they would they would they would they would um, make an ad like this. Now imagine this was a bunch of men. And first of all, men don't do this unless they're gay, right? <laughs> it's shit like this. Okay, you never you don't see a class full of men, you know, or gay men in particular doing shit like this. You don't. You know, and that's that's what I said. I said like once they you know how they hypersexualize black women. Eventually, it's going to go into their community too because these other women are going to see it. And one thing women seek is attention, right? So look at this woman. She had literally have her hands in me. You know, I just, but like I said, you know, hey, it's your business, but y'all put it out there, okay? Y'all put it out there, right? And so when I report, I say sometimes women, can, women are the worst. I'm not saying all women. I'm not saying a particular woman. I'm speaking in this manner in things like this but again as a black person as a truth speaker you cannot speak the truth and again i'm not speaking hate i speak the truth right we know who we know who teach hate we know who speak hate right we know who act on their hatred right so don't act as if because i did something like that that's that because i posted this and i said what i said that that hate hate speech i had a uh, conversation with woman she with woman she called me an uh, incel she called me this and all this all this stuff, right? Because I'm not feeding into her delusion. Because I'm actually giving her the facts. And they hate that. 
So they'll insult me. They'll say this. They'll say that. All this stuff. Right? But the fact that I love them more than they love themselves and they love their community, their children, and their men. Right? Because the people that people who say they love you and are lying to you don't love you. The people that tell you the truth, regardless of how it may make you feel, they're the ones that care enough about you to tell you the truth so that you know. Right? Not tell you things so that you will believe. But to tell the truth so that you will know. So you will have a, a, um, a realistic view on things and, and knowing the truth so that you can make better decisions that can better your life or the people and the people around you and your children and your community and your husband, your boyfriends, whatever. You, such and such. Same, same thing for the men. Right? I mean, come on now. They, they have been... This culture is, is, is about lies. And they're lying to young people. Right? And particularly young black people. And because of those lies, we believe and we get into trouble. Okay? Or we get into situations where we don't make the right decision because we've been manipulated. Not only by the lies, but covert psychological warfare and covert warfare against us. And so, you know, I'm not, listen, they're going to have to review this shit. I'm, I'm posting it, uh, you know, what have you, and I'll keep you guys up to date. All right. Talk to you guys in the next video.